Around Cincinnati. Brought to you by your local Toyota dealers. Visit buyatoyota.com. Welcome back, everyone. I'm Donna Ruco, and you're on the list. Now, you've probably driven past the Elsinore Water Tower dozens of times and wondered, well, what's inside? Janelle Walton puts on her climbing gear and takes you to the top. It's one of the three stories you'll be sharing around Cincinnati. At number one, inside the Elsinore Tower at Gilbert Avenue. First, it's not really a water tower. Back in 1883 when this was built, it was built as a valve control station to control the flow of water out of Eden Park Reservoir down into downtown Cincinnati. Next, it's inspired by Shakespeare. He, the then superintendent of the waterworks, A.G. Moore, went to a showing of Hamlet. He was so smitten with the Cronenberg Castle, which is what this is a replica of, that he commissioned the building of this structure. Let's go inside. I made it to the top of the castle. But I realized, what am I doing up here? I'm afraid of heights. Bye-bye. The tower is not open to public tours, but you can still appreciate its beauty. It is a relic of Cincinnati's past, and we intend to keep it in good shape. At number two, P&G's brands dominate the list of the most trusted household goods. Tide cleaned up in the detergent group. P&G's museum tells the story that it was coded Product X during its development until being called Tide. The name came from how clean the sand looked when the tide rolled out. The cell line was oceans of suds uh, because of how much suds that it could generate. At number three, just in time for the holiday weekend, WalletHub.com is telling Cincinnatians, stay home. The personal finance website ranks Cincinnati as the third best staycation destination. We're tops in most public golf courses, second in the number of swimming pools, and fifth in tennis courts. Now you're caught up and clued in. I'm Janelle Walton. Around Cincinnati, brought to you by your local Toyota dealers.